Hi, welcome to another video from Dr. Lock from Parramatta. We're just going to show you how to change the battery on a Nissan Elgrand remote control. Okay, first thing you do is you remove the key. So that's a key, we'll put that aside. So then you have your remote control like this. This is the battery that goes in it. These batteries here, this is a RCR2032. Try and use a decent brand one because you don't want to have to be doing this each year. The better the brand, the longer it's going to last. Use a flat blade screwdriver. Look for the side which has the access to it. There's a little tiny lump if you can see it there. Put your screwdriver in there, give it a little twist until it pops open. Work the screwdriver around. There we go, and it's popped out now. Okay, there's our battery right there if you can see it. And we're just going to pop that out. Just going to check. And it says CR2032, so that's our, definitely our battery. Just like one of these ones. Try to use a decent brand, it will save you a lot of trouble. You would normally replace your remote control battery when you go... Well, this is a proximity remote, so if you've got to go really close to the car, and your battery's low. If you find your remote control's not working, uh, first thing to do is just replace the battery and start with that. So we're placing it back in and we're replacing the writing. The writing is on that side and that's going face down. Okay, then we're just checking it there. What you do is you make sure it's even, even all the way around, even, and then you push it back together. You'll hear it click back in, test it, the light's working. And there you have it, replacing the battery in a Nissan Earl Grand remote control. Thanks for watching.